Delighted to be visiting with the Egyptian Society for Northern Ireland here this afternoon in their new offices in Lisburn, in my constituency. And as the local member of parliament, I've worked very closely with the Egyptian Society for many years. Uh, and it is great to hear about the progress that's been made by the Society. And after the COVID pandemic, that they are meeting together again. And this wonderful office will be a focal point for the activities of the Egyptian society. And over the years, this society has promoted good relations within our communities, has supported um, uh, ethnic minority groups, including many from an Arab background, many from Egypt, um, and some of our best professionals now in our health service in Northern Ireland uh, and in engineering and technology are people who come from Egypt and made their home here in Northern Ireland. Uh, and they will always be very welcome here. Uh, and so it's a pleasure to be able to support the work of the Egyptian Society in Northern Ireland as it continues. Uh, we wish them well with their new office here in Lisburn, uh, which will be a hub of activity, I have no doubt, um, as the Egyptian Society se seeks to uh, roll out its activities to engage with people uh, from an Egyptian background, also from uh, Arab communities across the world who've settled here in Northern Ireland. So we commend the work of the Egyptian Society for Northern Ireland and we wish them well for the future. Thank you. Thank you. On Unite Against Hate, um, a, an organisation called Cooperation Ireland is going to take over that work. So Unite Against Hate campaign is going to be renewed and it will that's be taken means, forward yeah, by Cooperation means. Ireland. So I think it would be good Afa, for you to meet mm -hmm the people from Cooperation Ireland and talk to them about what role the Egyptian society can play. And, and I note in your presentation you were saying the Egyptian and Arab society, so that's good, you've broadened it out as well. So um, I think it would be good for you to engage with Cooperation Ireland. On the funding, uh, you know, uh, Emma and I are more than happy to write letters of support when you're applying for funding, whether it's from the council or from the executive office. Emma uh, will get you some information about um, the Ethnic Minority Fund.